Hey, how's it going? I'm Wes Nuke. I want to bring Clean Air Lawn Care to Corpus Christi, Texas to show and teach the community that you can have a beautifully maintained lawn without the negative effects of a traditional landscape company. In kindergarten, I was mowing my, my family's front yard. In the eighth grade, I picked up my first commercial account. In high school, I went to go work for the local school district. And I remember starting out as the weed eater guy. After high school, I went to go work for several large landscape corporations across Texas. In 2007, I decided to open up Newcomb's Landscape. We started in my garage with three customers. At the end of the season, we had 36 customers and were continuing growing. 2009, my wife Marcia had to quit her job to take care of our special needs child. I had to close Newcomb's Landscape so I could go get a job that offered health insurance. Given this opportunity, I plan to donate a percentage of the profits to help South Texas Botanical Gardens. I've been Wes's friend since seventh grade, and as long as I've known him, he's been passionate about landscaping. I watched Wes and Marcia marry and buy their dream house in 2007. After trying for a year, they were ecstatic to find out they were pregnant in late 2008. At 32 weeks pregnant, tragedy struck. Their unborn baby had a severe case of HPE. Estella was born with a prognosis of only hours to live, and the Newcomb spent every waking moment in the NICU helplessly watching their baby struggle for life. To the disbelief of doctors, Estella lived a day, a week, a month, a year. She became a miracle in all of our lives and a symbol of hope to everyone who met her. Marcia became a round-the-clock nurse for Estella. Wes worked full-time and built his own landscaping company on the side. Through all of the trials and financial hardships, the Newcomb family treated each day as a gift. Because of the financial strains of a special needs child, the Newcombs were forced to move from their house in Kyle to a rundown trailer in Falls City and then to a small modular home in Corpus Christi. In June, the Newcombs found out there was going to be another addition to their family, but tragedy struck again when they found out that Heidi Marie was also going to have HPE. When we began making this video, it ended here. However, last Thursday, Estella passed away in her sleep. As this is being made, Wes and Moshia are juggling work, a baby on the way, and planning a funeral for their older daughter. And we're proud to say we're Wesley's mom and dad. All we can hope for and pray for is that these two kids finally get a break. And we're hoping that maybe this video will create that break that they so much deserve. Thank you for this wonderful opportunity. And please, vote for the Newcombs for clean air.